Hi everyone, welcome to this edition of Tips for iOS. I'm Ellen Sweeney, and in this episode, I'll show you how to use voicemail transcription in iOS 10. Most major carriers are set up for visual voicemail, but if you don't see it on your iPhone, you might want to check with your carrier. Visual voicemail transcribes the words that are spoken and displays the text right in the voicemail section of your iPhone app. When someone leaves you a voicemail message, open the phone app, tap on voicemail in the bottom right hand corner, and then tap on the message. The audio message starts to play automatically, and if the person just left the message, a transcribing message displays while the message is being transcribed. It may take some time for the transcription to appear. To share a transcript, press and hold on the message until the menu option appears. Drag the selection handles to the area of the message that you want to share, and then tap on Share. Now just select the app with which you want to share the message with. If the message includes information with a specific time or date, you can create a calendar event in the built-in calendar. Tap on the date or time in this transcript. As you can see, they will be underlined. And then tap on Create Event in the pop-up window. Enter the relevant information for the event. Tap Add to save it to your calendar. Since this is a beta product from Apple, reporting feedback will help make the service more useful in the future. As you can see at the bottom of the message, you can tap on useful or not useful. You will then have the option to send the voicemail message to Apple. If you want to keep the voicemail message private, just hit cancel. Your feedback will be sent, but without the voicemail message itself. Let me show you how that works. So I'm going to tap on not useful and here I have the option to submit that voicemail so that Apple can get a better handle on, you know, why it's not working. Or I can hit cancel and keep that voicemail private. I'm going to go ahead and hit submit. And now Apple will get the voicemail as well. If your voicemail transcripts aren't working, here are a few things you can try. Reset your phone. You know, hold the power button and the home button if you have a phone prior to the iPhone 7. If you have the iPhone 7, you'll hold the power button and the volume up or volume down button until the phone resets. You can also check for a carrier update by going to Settings, then General, and then About. And if there is a carrier update for your phone, it will automatically pop up. You don't need to do anything. If you're still having trouble, call yourself to see that voicemail is properly set up. And then as a last resort, you can try to reset your network settings by going to Settings and then go into General and then scroll down to the very bottom until you see Reset. And then what you're going to want to reset is your network settings. I hope you found this tutorial useful, and if you have any questions or comments, you can post them below the video. I'm Ellen Sweeney, and thanks for watching Tips for iOS.